Hello, it is Sunday, January the 13th, 2013. Uh, this is just an update of my plant stand, or at least part of it. I really wanted to show off this Syningia speciosa Bristol's Good Morning. This is the second year I've grown it, and I think I've learned a lot on growing it from last year. It's The blossoms are very nice. Spin it around a little bit. Oh, look, let me not mess it up. <laughs> I almost dropped it. That's a disaster. So I'll just leave it alone. Uh, right next to this is what I call, it's a Syningia speciosa. It's a purple brocade. I grew this from seed last year as well. And it's about to open. It gets very large. And um, it's a double, it's a double purple blossom. So I think I may try to cross the two of those in a few months. Uh, this one in the back is also a Syningia speciosa. I think it's a Charles Lawn hybrid. Uh, it has it's white with light uh, pink streaks in the center of it. I'm not really enthusiastic about the foliage of it. It was kind of ruffled and unruly last year. It seems to me that's going to be the case this, well, this year as well. So I may give that away or we'll just see how it goes. Uh, these are some other Syningias uh, that may be going dormant. I'm not sure. Uh, it's a columnia. I might put this in a different room where it gets more light. And then some T5 lights. And these are some Calarias. I think this one here is Calaria Peridos Rolo. And this one is a Calaria Napoleon V. One of the members of my club gave me this. And over there is the Streptocarpus Gloria. Uh, keeping it this budded. I may show it. I just wanted to see how big it was going to get. And that's it for this check-in. Just really wanted to show off this one right here. <laughs>